Have you guys ever been one bolt away from finishing your project and it just so happens that the threads have stripped out? Well, today I'm going to show you how to fix threads like these with a helicoil kit. Basically, these are stainless steel inserts that will replace the threads that were in the bolt hole before. And if your material is aluminum, it will actually be stronger than it was before because you'll be installing stainless steel threads. The tools required for this repair will be a helicoil kit, a drill bit, a tap socket, a punch or a screwdriver, a drill, and WD-40 or cutting fluid. To determine which kit you need, you'll need to know what the thread of the stripped hole was. Also, it tells you the drill bit size required on the packaging of the kit. We can see here it's 13 30 seconds. So before I start drilling this hole here, I want to make sure that I don't go too deep. So I'm going to use a caliper to determine the depth of this hole. And it looks to be about one inch. So now that we know the depth of the hole, we're using tape on the drill bit to make sure we don't go too deep. Okay, so the first thing we need to do is drill out this hole to prepare it for the tap for the helicoil. Make sure that you keep the hole lubed at all times with WD-40 or cutting fluid. When drilling, make sure that you're drilling into the hole as straight as possible. Once you're done drilling, grab parts cleaner and clean all of the shavings out of the hole. If you have an air compressor, you can use that too. Now that we have our bolt hole drilled out, we can start tapping it. Insert the supplied tap into your tap wrench or tap socket and start tapping out the hole. Once again, using WD-40 and cutting fluid as required. Okay, we've tapped the hole, so now we're going to remove the tap. So now that we've tapped the hole, we can install the helicoil. Depending on the kit that you bought, you might have an install tool and a pre-coil tool, or just an install tool. If you have a coarse thread kit, you will only have an install tool. If you have a fine thread kit, you will have an install tool and you will have a pre-coil tool. And basically what the pre-coil tool does is it compresses the insert to the correct size before installing it. So if you had a coarse thread kit, you would take your thread insert and your install tool and you would thread this onto the install tool until the tang got caught on that lip right there and then you would just install this into your threaded hole. If you have a fine thread kit, you will have the installation tool and the pre-coil tool, and you need to get the threaded insert into the threaded part of the pre-coil tool. So to do that, grab the threaded insert, slide it over the install tool until the tang catches the lip there, then install it into the pre-coil tool, and thread it into the threaded section of the pre-coil tool until it's at the surface, just like that. And we're using the tap wrench to drive the threaded insert through the pre-coil tool. Okay, so now we're gonna take our tool, line it up to the hole, and start installing the insert. This part can be really frustrating to line it up, but eventually you'll get it and it'll go in with ease, just like this. You can see how far it's gone in by looking at the side of your tool here. The coil is installed and we can see that it has threaded out of the pre-coil tool and into our newly tapped threads. So now we can unthread our installation tool from the coil and we can see that our helicoil has successfully been installed. The last thing that we have to do is snap off that tang with a punch but before we do so, I wanna make sure that my bolt threads into there. And it does. So we have successfully fixed the threads of this bolt hole. Let's snap off that tang. All right, guys, so that's it. We snapped off that tang, and that concludes the installation of a helicoil.